Hi everyone, Emma here. I am going to show you how to attach one of these clasps onto a finished bracelet. So these were done some time ago and I'll put the link for the video on how to make these. This is um, tubular herringbone and with the added crystals. So there's this one here and then this one is a little bit bigger and I kind of wanted to show you the silver set of uh, or stainless steel set of these amazing class. So they have a loop on the end. Let me uh, focus the camera here. So they have a loop on the end and so you do need some um, open jump rings. And then it has this awesome bead that has a silicone gasket inside and you can pull this up and down. So you can pull it to the bottom. It has these beads at the bottom that are nicely weighted so it'll dangle nicely but it also prevents this bead from coming off entirely. And what this does is you can slide this over your wrist and then snug it up. So I'll show you how to do that as well. So let's get started. This is a BB Craft collaboration. So I got these stainless steel slider bracelets. And let's see what it says. Oh, 12 centimeters. I was like, I can't even read my own writing. That's pretty bad. So this was a set of 50 for $20. And there was a set of 50 of the gold colored ones, and it was $24. So you can see I've used a lot of gold, but plus this container is pretty big too. So, um, yeah, so let's get started. It's super simple. You're going to need your pliers. So let's start with the gold one. And we're going to open that jump ring up open so just twist them so that it's open and then slide on your and I I had made these let me enlarge this I had made these bracelets with um, wire guardians on them so that because I wasn't sure what to put on there let's grab our clasp the closed jump ring and let's hook this on first and then put the bracelet it doesn't matter which way you put it on as long as you put one on one side and one on the other super simple and then close that up and let's open this up here just to give us more space to work with the other side so grab the other link jump ring And so I could potentially finish a whole bunch of bracelets <laughs> that's been sitting on my desk without class. I know you guys tell me the same thing that <laughs> you do the same. I find sometimes, well, first of all, making the bracelet is so much fun. And, but finishing them sometimes is... It's not that it's not any fun, it's just I want to keep playing with the beads. <laughs> so they, they go off. I have a little tray that's full. So this is awesome to get me organized and finish these guys up. And that. Like that. Oh, this is looking lovely. Oh, let's try this on. So you just slide it on. Look at how easy that goes on. Now, this bracelet's long. Like, it's long enough to fit. My my wrist is a six-inch wrist. So it is kind of a small bracelet. But now it goes from being a small bracelet to fitting somebody who has, say, a seven-and-a-half-inch wrist. And look at how easy that is to slide. So for me, I would say this is way too long. And if you were going to do this, you could actually just do the, th you know, the three sets of crystals and this part here leave off 
and attach one of these. And these clasps are really popular right now. When I started doing a search, I was surprised like big jewelry companies are using these. So this is lovely. So somebody's going to get a lovely gift. Let's write down. Look at that. That is awesome. So let's do the next one. So you get an idea of what the silver looks like. So don't forget um, the coupon code for BB Craft is Emma10. And you get 10% off your entire order. And anything after $25 is free shipping. So it's a really good deal. If, you know, you need the supplies. We always need supplies. The beaters. My wife caught me. I was, I just purchased some bulk um, seed beads. And I was putting them in containers. She came into my office. She says, why am I not surprised that you're sitting there with a desk full of beads? I'm like, shh, shh. Get out of my office. Who invited you? So there's one. Yeah. So let's open this one up. These um, jump rings are 18 gauge, so that's why it was a little hard to open. Let me get this. So these are really lovely. The attachments. And then there. And nicely closed. So let's try this one. Again, this was measured exactly for my wrist size, which is six inches. So <laughs> look at how long. Look at how easy this is. That's pretty. And of course, look. So I would, again, this is super long. So this is like a really nice length. Um, you could use this. A few people mentioned using them for necklaces, but you'd really have to pay attention to how um, to be able to get the necklace over your head. So the length, it, I mean, just go with the 12 centimeters on top and have some wiggle room. So that is that. That's how easy these are. I'm super stoked that I was able to get these bracelets completed thank you bb craft so there you go let me uh enlarge this a bit so you can see and there it is so thanks for joining me and don't forget emma 10 gives you 10 percent off and all the links will be in the description and i'll have the link for this video as well on how to make these there we go take care bye